Hello everybody, welcome to the I Am IT YouTube channel. My name is Shabazz Dan, as ever, I'm the IT Geek. Welcome back to another Nerdio Wednesday where I'm going through my top 10 NME features. So I think I'm at number seven right now, so we're week seven of this. So it's one, obviously I do I do this Nerdio Wednesday, I do it once a week, every Wednesday. Um, so I've been working through different features in NME that I, I find are a step above the rest. Nerdio and Manager for Enterprise has loads, hundreds of features, right? But these are top these are 10 that I feel are probably outstanding ones and my favourite ones specifically. So this is my list. You'll all have your own list, which I do ask you to share. You know, drop me a comment with what that is. Um, so we're at number seven today. Now this is one which is um, it's very specific. So a lot of the features I've spoken about so far, you can actually replicate in things, you know, maybe Intune or Azure or, or you know, Windows 65 or whatever, you know, their native deployments but or native management tools. But... With NME, it just makes it so much easier and, 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 and quicker, and it's all automated. Now, this one is, is kind of specific. I think it's specific because I've not seen it on, on Intune anyway. So it's an Intune integration one. But it's around policy management and actually being able to back up your policies. Best feature ever. All right, not quite best feature, but a really, really cool feature. The fact you can, you know, if you, you create all these policies, what happens if one gets, what happens if one gets deleted by mistake or whatever? Here you are able to to um, back those up, right? So we give it just a name for the change log. Give it any tags that you might want to give it. Um, you can write anything you want there. And then, then you have the backup assignment. So this, by enabling backup assignment policy assignments, will be backed up and can be restored. And then backup will be created for policy template. Um, and you can stop on the, the first failure. But you create that, that'll create the backup of that. And again, then you can just restore it as and when you want, right? Um, so let's say we do something wrong. We can might get deleted by mistake. You can manage backups. And we can restore it from one of these two backups. So again, very, very powerful to be able to do that. And I, I've not seen that feature in Intune, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but it's not just with compliance policies. Any policy you have, you can manage backups. You can back it up with a security baseline if you, if you have any of those control access policies. Um, I don't think you do with conditional access because these are specific to Entra. That's right. Yeah, yeah. So these are specific to Entra, I think. So you can't do it on these. But again, if you go into an application, you can you can back those up. Same with Windows Update because that's um, using update rings, right? Uh, so that is number seven in my list. The the really cool being able to back up your policies from Intune. Um, and again, it's not a feature I've really seen in Intune. So again, something something that that um, puts enemy on Nerdio as well on its own in that area. You know, just great features, great intuitive features. And again, helping you manage wind, you know, cloud, wind, Microsoft specific cloud PCs, um, and just be a bit more secure. You know, backups is, is such an important part, and being able to back up policy specifically from an administrator's perspective gives you a bit of peace of mind, right? And you can, you know, you can you can back up all your policies and and have sort of schedules around that as well. So a bit of a short video there, but I just wanted to say that that is my my, my top 10 as well. I really do like that feature. Um, so hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. I've got, you know, a lot of people that look at my analytics and a lot of people watch my videos are subscribed, which is weird. Um, so please do subscribe to my channel. Got loads of content coming up. I have loads of different content, as you can tell. This this is specific to Nerdio Wednesday. But during the week, you know, Mondays, and so I do I do three videos a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I do some YouTube lives within that as well. Um, but I am trying to grow my channel, and I'm I'm hitting, you know, I, I've not got a target. I've not given myself a target at the end of the year, if I'm honest, because um, I just didn't feel like it. I, I didn't feel like putting that pressure on myself. Originally, I wanted to get 50k, but I smashed that like months ago. So I thought, you know what, whatever it is at the end of the year is great as a bonus, as far as I'm concerned. I've already smashed my target, so probably in January I'll set my new target. Who knows? I might be daring and set that 100k. We'll see. Um, but anyway, loads of useful links in the description. Please do do take, check those out. Drop me a comment with what your favourite NME features are uh, in in this video as well. So thank you for joining me. Until next time, goodbye.